just arrived at this big ass house. It is now quarter past two in the morning. I've been awake for over 21 hours. So I'm gonna jump in to this nice big bed, get some sleep, and I'll give you an MTV crib style tour of the house tomorrow. What's going on guys? So I'm gonna do give you my MTV style cribs tour of this absolutely beautiful, beautiful house behind me. So we've got to jack up this big drive to start off. The views are absolutely incredible. So we have a double garage. And there is Front door number one, head straight into the living room. We're gonna go in through the kitchen. Big open plan kitchen. Nigel and his millions. Same views. Out onto the hills. Now we're heading up the stairs. This is the view that I woke up to this morning. Jeez. How nice is that? We have a log burner. through from the living room. We've got bedroom here, bedroom here, and we've got a bathroom here. Another front door. We have my and Alex's bedroom going through to the garden. Then we head on upstairs. So that's three bedrooms already. We're heading on upstairs. This is master room. Another room with a view out onto the garden. More chill views. Upstairs bathroom. Then we have this second master bedroom with absolutely incredible views. Let's see if we can take you guys outside. I would step out, but I'm gonna get wet feet. So, this is the view. So as you can see in the background, I have the beach. So we're gonna walk down to the beach today. A nice chill walk down to the coast and enjoy our afternoon. How incredible is this house, guys? So, I'm gonna head down to chill down here. Oh. Gonna head down, grab some breakfast, and then we're off out for a walk. Um, like I said, I'm keeping food as low as I can and easy trackable so I'm going to have a protein bar and some crumpets and then carbs will be replaced by alcohol because why not um, I'll probably only have two meals today keep the calories down nice and low so alcohol can be consumed and we can stay on track so breakfast today is a cheeky little treat of mine. It is two crumpets, toasted, then thrown in the microwave, and a Pro2Go SciTech Nutrition Protein Bar mounted on top. Obviously we're still keeping on track. We're now 15 uh, weeks, yeah, 15 weeks away from body power. 
So still got to keep on track this weekend. We go for a walk, I can have a few drinks at the local pubs because some nice pubs around here and we all know that I love a good drink. Um, but literally this is just a chill, go out for a walk, eat, drink, sleep, recharge, have fun, but we're going to stay on track. We'll be eating out tonight, all I'll do is keep protein high um, while I'm eating out and alcohol will be my carbohydrates. So switch it in, switch it out, no carbs, have alcohol instead, a few ales and then keep protein high so steak chicken uh, that type thing maybe a little side salad and a few ales so you can switch in carbs and fats for alcohol obviously it's only a couple of days so i'm not training so my performance isn't going to be low because my carbs are low um but i will fill those carbs so i'll have high protein and then fill my carbs with ale so i am going to sign out from this weekend guys hope you enjoyed the house and um, I will check in on Monday we will be into our third week of prep with 15 weeks to go recharging this weekend and then let's go kill the week so what's going on guys <laughs> it is the 29th of January I'm back from my long weekend away three days in Willicum I hope you enjoyed the house, it was absolutely incredible. I struggled to stay on track, but I learned a few things about myself. So when I went out, I didn't eat, I opted for lower calorie foods, because I was gonna have a few drinks. I also opted for child's meals. So I was lower on calories because I was eating child's meals, and I wasn't eating full adult meals to keep my calories down, and I also, really got hungry while I was away because I knew that I would be eating, that I would be drinking calorific drinks. Um, so I actually, I've, I really learned something about myself. It sounds stupid that I said I went on a retreat away and I learned something about myself, but I didn't, I learned that I can actually go a lot longer without food um, than I thought I could. So it was a great weekend away, lots of family time, Lots of excitement, lots of walking, cleared my head, didn't do any work while I was away. And I thought I'd check in with you guys now. I've just killed my Monday upper body session. I did bench press, lat pull down, neutral grip. I did close grip bench, so mainly the triceps because every day is arm day. I did some standing cable rows and also some standing tricep extension and some bicep curl finishing off with some cable flies 15 weeks away from body power so i thought i'd have a physique check in with you guys right now so posing is definitely not on point Something I will be brushing up on closer to the day. So we should be ready for the photo shoot in five weeks' time. Then we have the Saxon Classic four weeks after, and we're 15 weeks away from the big day at Body Power. Something I want to ask you guys as well is, what do you want to see in these vlogs? Do you want to see my life or do you want to see fitness? Please comment, put comments in the comment section and I will bring you guys what you want.